the story guys welcome back to GTO it's Aaron here today in this video I got something absolutely ridiculous to show you which I never thought I would see in overwatch guys it's it's football in overwatch in a first-person shooter like what the fudge brownies is going on here man and you know um, me in particular and us at GTO we absolutely love Rocket League man and you know anything with football like this is crazy man so we've done it with FIFA with humans we've done it with with Rocket League with cars and now we're doing it with superhuman superpower ability crazy guys in Overwatch it's ridiculous guys so as you can see me there I'm actually just after scoring a goal so it's three versus three uh, everyone plays as Lucio you can't kill anybody you're definitely not able to kill anybody uh, you can't actually shoot your gun what you use is like a melee to hit the ball so or two will just be like your punch you have your boost to make you go quicker and you have your sonic blast so that's how you actually maneuver around the game that's actually how it goes down now you can see there I'm actually getting another goal so if you hit that ball in the sweet spot just like Rocket League you punch it and it'll go in like you see it here I get a it kind of tease off for me boom another little punch there and it goes straight down but it, it reminds me a lot of Rock League, man, like the, the way the stadium is um, designed. The size of the pitch is very similar to Rock League, maybe a little bit smaller, but it's also 3v3. And that's the standard mode in Rock League. It curves at the side to make the balls go in easier. Now, actually, guys, you can also wall run in this as well. You don't see me doing much in this video because you have to hold down X, um, which is it's pretty crazy. I can see, you know, you can get, eventually get good uh, goals in that. But you can see these boost pads around here. You see me just jumping up there like crazy. Those, those like, there's uh, about three boost pads, I believe, on each side of the pitch, um, which obviously helps you jump up in the air for the crazy ones. And, oh, man, <laughs> it's a very fun game to play. This is only, I believe, my second or third game of it. And it's, it's actually really fun, man. I haven't even played it with my friends yet. So I can only imagine how, how funny and crazy you'll be playing with your friends. But I absolutely love it, guys. I think it's really cool the way Blizzard, like Overwatch, the way they just, they put stuff th like this in. Like, you know, obviously the Olympics are coming out. Uh, Olympics are starting very, very soon. And they're having this in time with it. They call it the Summer Games. It's obviously inspired by the Olympics. And I just think that's really cool, guys. Like, that's a free update. I wasn't expecting this at all, guys. To be honest, I, I loaded my, up my... Um, I noticed there was an update today. And I loaded it up and I realized, oh, wow. I actually had to look up the notes. And I was like, oh, Lucio Ball is in here. And what, the per what a perfect character to use for it as well. Because he's quick. He's obviously from Brazil. Uh, you know, Brazil famous for football, of course. And yeah, guys. It, this is... This is absolutely crazy. I just can't believe they added this in. It's it's a lot of fun. It's it's a nice relaxed thing, you know. I actually ended up losing this game, I think, guys. But you know what? You don't even care if you lose, guys. Really, it's it's all. This is just a nice relaxing, you know. If you want to get away from competitive, you're getting screwed over and that. You just want to laugh and smile and and have fun with your friends and uh, mess around. This is the game mode to play, guys. I I as I said, I played three or four games of it only, and I've, I love it. And I was playing by myself with randoms, and it, it was really good fun. Um, I'm assuming it's just going to be limited time uh, because of the Olympics. But who knows? Maybe people will love it so much. Maybe they'll have to keep it in after the two or three weeks when this is uh, when this event is over and the Olympics are over. But yeah, it's 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 really good. It's set in Brazil as well. The stadium looks awesome. Very Rocket League inspired, guys. Like look at the look at the ball. Like even just look at the ball and picture Rocket League and the size of the ball. Like I think Psyonix would be watching this right now and be saying, "Ah, these guys did a good job, man. They, their version of Rocket League with Overwatch is actually really, really good." And uh, yeah, you can see there now. What's the score at the moment? Three two at the moment. I'm pretty sure it goes. Um, yeah, I'll just tell you guys, it's a very, very tight finish at the end. But yeah. <laughs> I just, I just, I'm still in shock even watching it now, guys. Honestly, I just can't believe they put this in the game, guys. It's fuck, it's fucking amazing. And they also have those loot boxes as well, guys. Um, they have these special loot boxes, um, event loot boxes they're called. If you get one, you're guaranteed. So you could get like maybe like an Irish skin, Irish flag skin. You could get, you get like China flags. I think I got a China flag. Obviously, I'm assuming every country limits. The There's probably hundreds and hundreds of. Um, uh, loot, loot items in these boxes for sure just for the Olympics which is crazy and what are we at at the moment now or sorry it's only 3-2 at the moment now is it they've just after going in the lead or actually no sorry we actually just equalized there my bad that confused me in the uh, in the goal cam that kind of confused me it went up but yeah this is it's crazy I like the way they show the goals like that similar to Rock League again um, 
I don't really know why they show the health on the characters. Maybe that's just default in the other game modes. But you, you get... I, I haven't died in this, guys. Oh, yeah. And another thing to say. Now that I think about it. The ultimate... I was very unsure what the ultimate does. But I'm pretty sure, guys... It actually sucks in the ball towards you. Like, it tries to... So if you're kind of... If you're, like, magnetized towards the ball. So the ultimate is, like, different than it is in um, real life. Or in the actual game, should I say. So... <laughs> Yeah, it's it's a good game mode, guys. Punishing, shooting, blocking, sliding on the wall. Like, guy got a save there. It just, it works really, really surprisingly well. I didn't think it would work this smoothly. And I, like, obviously, you can see I'm quite newbie at it. But if as long as you can get your positioning down, judge the um, the pace of the ball and stuff, you you'll be fine, man. You'll be you'll be golden. But yeah. That's about it in the video, guys. Um, I'm going to leave it there. I just thought I'd, I said I have to. Once I saw this up, I said I have to make a video on Lucio Ball. Because I love football. I absolutely love Rocket League. And I absolutely love Overwatch. So it's a mixture of all of them, guys. And the Olympics as well. What a thank you, Blizzard, for adding this in. Like, that's really cool, you guys. Free updates like this is gives me faith in gaming and developers. And that's just brilliant. But look at that there, guys. Right at the end to lose the game. What was there? One second left? literally one second left literally and they score all the length of the pitch but that was very upsetting guys i still uh love the game nonetheless uh that's all i got for this video guys play the game and don't let the game play you i'm aaron and i'll catch you on the next one take it easy guys peace out